Hello, welcome to a short tutorial on Winsim, the simulation of limited bacterial growth. We're starting with a new model and set the properties of the model, the starting time, the end time, the time step. We're adjusting the saving time and the units for the time, which is minutes. Okay, let's add a level. Level is bacterial density. Let's add a rate. Bacterial density is increased by the growth rate of the microorganisms. Let's add a parameter which is the growth parameter and we're adding oops we're adding in addition a parameter which is the maximum OD OD max now let's connect the variables bacterial density is influencing of course the growth rate the growth parameter it has an influence on the growth rate and the maximum OD let's assume that it has an influence on the growth parameter and also the bacterial density a click on equations makes the unfinished equations visible we starting with the bacterial density so we're adding a starting value which is 0 0.01 a unit which is OD optical density so we're adding a unit and a number for the OD max which is 5 and also OD optical density as a unit we're uh, editing the equation for growth parameter which is 0 0.03 times parentheses open OD max minus bacterial density parentheses close, close divided by OD max So what would the unit of this be is uh, since this is a parameter which gives us the uh, doubling per minute it's one per minute and so what remains is the growth rate growth rate is calculated by growth parameter times bacterial density so we've got the unit and the units are here OD per minute so the optical density change per minute and now let's check the model Ch the model is okay let's check the units uh, oh there is a saving mark so we want to save the model we uh, call it growth limited savings complete and then oh there is one unit error discovered so where does this come from? Oh, it comes from the growth parameter which is calculated by a dimensionless uh, variable times another value and this should give an, an, a unit which is not possible so we have to introduce another auxiliary variable we call it the normalizing parameter we're deleting the arrows and adding arrows to from the bacterial density to the normalizing parameter as well from the OD max to the normalizing parameter we have to change the equations so the normalizing parameter gets the same equation parentheses open OD max minus bacterial density divided by OD max and we need another arrow connecting the normalizing parameter to the growth rate 
here we just erase from the growth parameter the normalizing parameter and then we're editing the equation for the growth rate and uh, adding times the normalizing parameter okay it and then we just check the model model is okay check the units units are okay as well and then we can run the model so what we do is we change the name of the data set which is now called growth and setting the simulation basically what we do is change the calculation method from Euler to uh, Runge-Kutta and then finally we get the result which is a nice very nice uh, output from a bacterial growth curve as expected